Okay, so today I'm actually going to show you how to create what you see on the screen here. And what this is, is a custom fan page tab in the fan page area. And uh, you'll notice that there is a video screen in the center of this page. And when I click on that and click again, you'll see that a video plays. And I'm going to show you how to actually create this page and also how to change out that video so you can put whatever video you want in there. And as a bonus, I'm actually going to offer the code for this design for $19.99, which is a very minimal cost for what you're getting. And uh, you simply just have to copy and paste it and then throw it into your page and then change the video. I'm gonna walk you through all those steps so it's really simple and really easy for you to do and uh, then show you where the code is actually available for you to purchase. Okay, so the first step you want to do is you want to upload your video to Facebook. And Facebook's been doing some weird things with video uploads. Sometimes it uploads, sometimes it doesn't. I find that about 99% of the time, if I do it this, this way, the, the video uploads. So what you're going to do is go to your homepage, click on Photos and uh, you'll see some links on here and you just want to click on upload a video and then you, you can just select the the video and uh, you know just upload it and once it's uploaded you're going to go to I can give you the actual URL here the URL to view all the videos that you have uploaded uh, maybe I can't give you the URL but basically you just have to go to home and then go again to photos and then my uploads and you'll get a list of all the videos that you've ever uploaded to Facebook. So let's say that I want to embed this video here. What I would do is just click on this and go into the screen where I can edit the video and tag people and things like that. And you'll notice a link on here that says embed this video. So when you click on that, you get a bunch of code and you're going to want to copy that code just hit OK and then you're going to take that and you're going to paste it into a text editor. I like to use Notepad. It's really simple to use and uh, if you don't have Notepad you can use a uh, you can start a new email and actually just paste it in the body of an email and what you're going to do is you're going to you're actually going to uh, you're going to come back to this because we're going to go to the FBML code which I have on another screen here and this would be the code that I'm going to make available for for you to purchase. It's $19.99 and, and the end result is a page that looks like this. And then you just swap out the video for whatever video you want to use. Okay, so we're going to paste the actual FBML code in here. And right at the top of this code, you'll see where it says Facebook Video Embed. And within that you'll see a URL that says HTTP, you know, facebook.com, V forward slash, and then there's a number. This is actually the video ID number. So above this, you remember I pasted in the embed code from the video I wanted to use. And also in this code, you have the same URL, you know, facebook.com, V forward slash, and then the video ID number. So I'm gonna wanna take that video ID number copy it and then paste it into my FBML code for that custom page. And then once we have that code ready, we're going to go into our fan page. And I'm kind of doing the extended version of the tutorial here for those of us that don't have fan pages created, but it's really simple. Um, you're just going to go into on any page in Facebook, the bottom link you can click on advertising and then new page opens click on pages and then you would just create a page and then you simply walk through the steps once your page is created you're going to go to a, a Facebook application called static FBML and you can just do that by typing that in the search bar and you'll find it once you get there you're gonna click on add to my page and uh, you'll get a list of the pages. I have several pages that I administer. Uh, let's say, for example, okay, so we're going to add this to Activia. I just click on Add to Page, and it's added that application to that page. And then we're actually going to go to Activia. 
And once we get there, we're going to want to go into edit page. And in the application list, you'll see an application that's called FBML. Now, the first thing I like to do is actually, I don't, I don't really care for boxes. I think it kind of makes, uh, it's, it's a messy representation of what you're trying to display. So the first thing I like to do is go into application settings, remove box, and then add tab. And then just hit okay. And then I'm gonna go into edit. And the first step I'm gonna do is I'm gonna select a, the name of my custom tab. Uh, you know, some popular ones out there are welcome, and you know I, I like see this or you know check it out you, you got to be careful because there is a character limit so if you put too many words in there Facebook will just cut it off so let's just do I like see this as you can see it already came up I like see this and that's gonna actually be the title of the tab and then the next box here is where we're going to place our FBML code so I'm gonna go back to notepad I'm gonna grab that code and then I'm going to go back here. I'm going to paste that code in the box there and I'm going to hit save changes. Now, when we go back to Activia's fan page, you'll see a new tab here that says, see this. We click on see this and there you go. We have our custom fan page and also within this code, I've included the comments section. So your visitors can uh, leave comments on your page. So this is just a uh, you know, quick tutorial on how to get a video embedded into a page in Facebook. And then the bonus is actually if you want to get your hands on the code to actually use this page for your fan area and have a custom page for your visitors. I, I will have details in the end of this video that will show you how to do that. So thank you for watching.